In this video, we're going to show you how you can change your design so it fits your corporate identity perfectly. Our virtual assistant will give you the tour. Have fun! The design of your proposals is driven by a design template. A design template can control the design of multiple proposals and does not affect the proposal content. The best way to show how it works is using an example. Here you will see an example proposal with the design template called All Purpose. When you view the proposal in preview mode, it looks like this. Now I change the design template to marketing and refresh the preview. As you can see, the whole look and feel has changed, but the content has remained the same. The design of your proposals is controlled by the design templates that you can find under the settings menu. Within your template, you can set the logo, fonts and colors. Let's start setting up the logo. The logo is displayed by default in the proposal viewer and therefore does not need to be inserted on all pages. Click on the logo to open the media browser. With the upload button, I'm now uploading a logo. Through the edit button I can open the image editor, with which I can put the image in the correct format with the crop tool. There is already a setting for the logo. After cropping and saving the image, I select it in the media browser. The logo is now updated and perfectly in the correct size. For the font you can choose from one of the system fonts and the huge Google Fonts library. You can set all the text's format with the right settings and see the effect of your settings in the preview. Furthermore, in this section of the design template you can also design your tables and determine how much white space is added around a paragraph. Via the Interface tab you change the Proposal Viewer to your corporate identity. The proposal viewer is the environment in which your proposal is displayed, it allows customers to navigate, ask questions and sign the proposal online. You will immediately see an update in the mini previews of your changes. You also have the option to determine how the page transitions animate and which options are visible in the proposal viewer. When you create a new page, it's nice to start with a default design. In the design template you can set these default settings under the magazine and paper tabs. Adjustments here will only take effect if you create a new page and will not be applied to existing pages and proposals. With proposal type paper you have the option to load a stationery as a background. This is only visible in the PDF view. You can assign a design template to a proposal favorite through the item settings. Through the proposal details you can configure which design template to use. And when you create a new proposal, you get an option to choose your template. From the proposal editor you can also customize the design template. 
Please note that your design adjustments also affect the appearance of other proposals that use this design template. Now I'm going to insert a page and change its appearance through the page settings. Because I make the background dark, I turn on the option where all the texts in that column turn white. At the right column I change the background image. Of course, my page also needs text, and therefore insert a paragraph. From the top menu, I apply the text styles from my design template to my title. I also insert a text and image paragraph, with which I can easily create layouts with images. Through the paragraph settings, I change the image position to the left, and the text to the right. This was the tour in which you saw the most important parts, with which you can set the design. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, we will be happy to help you through our support website.